Hi guys, welcome back. This is Maths 3000. Today we're going to talk about the maths facts of the number 15. So the first question then, is the number odd or even? Well, 15 is odd because it's not a multiple of 2. So next thing then is, what are the factors of 15? So factors are the numbers which go into the number. So let's start off with the 1 times table. So 1 goes into 15 15 times. 2 doesn't go into 15. The next times table is 3. 3 goes into 15 5 times. 4 doesn't go into 15. And then we're back to 5. So that's all our factors here. So our factors are 15 are 1, 3, 5 and 15. So our next question is 15 a prime number? Well, a prime number only has two factors, one in itself. This has four factors, so the answer to this question is no. Is it a square number? If it's a square number, we should be able to square root 15 to give a whole number. So the square root of 15 is 3.87. So since that's not come out as a whole number, then it's not going to be a square number. So is it a cube number? So if it's a cube number, we should be able to cube root 15 to give a whole number. So the cube root of 15, again we're getting a decimal here, so that's 2.47. So again, the answer to this is no. Uh, what is 15 in Roman numerals? I can write that with an X for 10 and a V for 5. And what are the other properties of uh, 15? Well, we can write 15 as the sum of the first uh, 5 integers. So we've got 1, add 2, add 3, add 4, add 5. And that all adds up to 15. So if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.